Welcome to the Crypto News. In this video, Plan B, the creator of the stock to flow model and supporter of Bitcoin, explains why this is the best Bitcoin buying opportunity ever. Listen to what he has to say. Well, the whole market, of course, went down. We didn't reach the 100k targets that talking about on Twitter and uh, the stock to flow model, of course, uh, predicts. So I have experienced that a couple of times now. It's the third time, actually, because uh, it always goes in waves. And when, when the price is high, then, then you're hot. And you're the man, the myth, the legend. And when the price is low, then plan bullshit, the scammer and what have you. Kind of get, get used to it. But like most Bitcoiners, in, in, if the price is not, not very exciting, they go um, do other stuff. It, those are actually the most productive periods. So for me, I traveled a lot, actually, uh, to other countries that would uh, that I could go to. As an unvaccinated person, I cannot go to the US or Canada, for example. So no Miami for me. But well, other countries, I won't say which ones, of course. But uh, uh, yeah, so I talked to a lot of people. I took some uh, some time off Twitter. You might have noticed that the, in those periods, the tweets are kind of general and not very specific and, and based on real-time analysis. But it was, yeah, it was kind of a kind of a holiday kind of meeting people face to face have met a lot uh, through zoom yeah a lot of business opportunities so you you guys must have had the same every conversation you have you have ideas you have opportunities and you want to you, you can almost start a business every day <laughs> so you have to search that out and there was of course time for some analysis and some um, thinking uh, which is also very good to do from time to time in all the so when prices uh, go sky high you you you're on podcasts every day if you if you don't uh, watch your agenda and right now it's it's uh, it's a great time to, to do analysis to think things over and yeah also business wise yeah very, very exciting uh, although I'm right now I'm kind of ready for the next move up I mean narratives is nice it's for newspapers for marketing stuff and um, there are some deeper trends some deeper things going on here and it's really said is of course technological it is the better money so like the internet if, if, if you want it or not it will be the less the, the third or dynamically better thing it will win in the end the earth is round not flat and whether you spin a narrative around it that it's flat it doesn't matter maybe it delays it a couple of years but uh, it will win so and also financially it's it is an asset it is a, an accepted asset more so than a couple of years ago yeah i agree and and at the risk of being called a moon boy which i'm called anyways yeah all the signals uh, whether you look fundamental and i mean well like stock to flow for example uh, with that or on chain realized cap or other metrics or in the news the macro news the number of countries that are opening up to bitcoin everything is positive of course there can be a black swan of course something can happen we haven't seen in the past or that is a real black swan but yeah volatility is low like willie said that the, the futures premium is low i watch that like a hawk that will uh, go up again if the um, leverage will uh, will enter the market again but even yeah the dormant coins the, the people in profit the people in loss i can't imagine unless a black swan any other scenario that this is one of the best buying opportunities that we have seen in the entire history of bitcoin it, it's compatible to the beginning 2016 2011 2013 12 even the beginning of the bull run so it's, it's yeah it's i know that sounds like like moon boy stuff but that's how i look at it it feels like we went full cycle in one year yeah. uh, we had the bull market in, in in may indeed and then we went through a full bear market from an on-chain uh, perspective but it doesn't fit and not in price of course because yeah. we didn't go down minus 80 percent. so i get that some people still waiting till well bitcoin drops to 20 or something from all other perspectives we are at the rock bottom if we just extrapolate from what we know yeah a second or a third el salvador would really change the game if, if el salvador is a small uh, country would not be alone in latin america but mexico or brasilia or argentina would join them that would make the case so much stronger and so much more difficult for the IMF to crush. So that's something I really watch. And then just the uh, normal demand from normal people that go through the institutions, people putting their pensions in Bitcoin, people buying Bitcoin themselves from an exchange. I see it all around me. It's There's a lot of people that think this is a good time to buy Bitcoin and they DCA in. Of course, you have to be very careful with that. But I see it around me. A lot, a lot, a lot more people are asking, 
hey, how do you set up a wallet? And I think that very small adoption is also very important. And that's what we're seeing as well. Yeah, Marco is, we are seeing things that we have never seen before. So we are in uncharted territory. For example, Greg Foss is a nice uh, guy to follow, a, a credit investor, Canadian. He has never seen what we're seeing right now. He's amazed. It's, it's very interesting. Every investor, well, in Europe, the negative interest rates. In the US, the interest rates, the 10 years are, are going through the roof right now. Inflation, of course, all driving this. Well, there's a couple of things we, we have to see. The inflation is not coming, is not caused by the narratives, that, by, by what the narratives of the mainstream media are telling us. Because they're telling us it's all because of Putin or it's because of COVID. Or no, we had this going on, actually, if you, <laughs> there's some nice stats and charts about it. Uh, since, since Biden, for example, uh, got into office, was elected. And even before that, the money printing that we have seen since 2008, basically, the acceleration of money printing since the financial crisis would have led to inflation regardless of what happened after it. So, of course, they will blame it on Putin or COVID or whatever. But in the end, we as investors, and especially Bitcoin investors, of course, know and have to keep the eyes on the prize. It's because of the money printing. And that's where the scary part is as well. So the big question now is, will the uh, central banks and the governments get things under control by raising the interest rate? That's how they normally do it. And stop money printing. Well, of course not. I don't see them doing that because that will crash everything of value. Real estate, the stock market, bond markets, everything. And they will have to reduce spending, which they can't. They need the money to, to fund the military or some social program or, or keeping banks alive or keeping other companies alive. So I think they'll see it. It becomes very hard to keep the inflation in, in tame, but in, the tame inflation. So what the other scenario is we get runaway inflation or maybe even hyperinflation like we see in emerging markets, right? In Venezuela, Zimbabwe, more and more like Turkey now, Argentina. It's unthinkable that we have that we will have that in, in Europe or um, or in the US right now. There, I think there's nobody really of the institutional investors that thinks that's a possibility. But but history has shown us that once every 70 or 100 years there is this big well, hyperinflation or, or reset moment that is necessary to keep things going. And and um, uh, Roosevelt did that with the gold uh, making gold illegal, the Gold Act in the, in, in 1930. Three, and Nixon did it in, in 1971, of course, by decoupling uh, the dollar of the gold. So I guess the other scenario is something like that, a, a new currency, global currency, a yeah um, debt um, cancellation, um, a big default. So some big structural big swan event is could be on the horizon, and, and, and we can't think of what it is but it will be ugly. So either the central banks or the governments get it under control, which they never had in the last 500 years, or some natural thing, some bad thing, some some yeah, bit of a disaster will cause a big reset of everything and then we'll have to start over again. And, and as an investor, of course, you have uh, very little time to uh, maneuver yourself in a position that you're not wiped out. I have bad news for you. If you're not rich by now, you're screwed. And if you're in debt, you're even double screwed. How so, you might wonder. Well, the sad truth is that you're working your whole life to make someone else rich. The mega corporations, the banks, the politicians, everyone is getting richer. They get your money. And what is even worse, they get your time. They get your life. You are not even in a rat race you're in a financial prison. But what could a solution for you look like? Honestly, I don't know, but I know what a solution for me would look like. It's very simple. I use whatever money I have and I multiply it with 1,000. This could make my life much easier and probably yours as well. If you have $1,000 available and multiply this with 1,000, I believe that this could solve some financial issue for the one or the other. Of course, if you're ugly, you would have to multiply it with much more than 1,000. My name is Marco Stan, and this is what I decided to do. I decided to 1,000x my money. This is not a joke. I know what you may be thinking. You know, what, what, what is this guy talking about? You know, how should this work? This is not possible. Well, I made a detailed video where I laid out my plan. And some clever folks might even want to look at this plan 
and copy it and do exactly what I do. This is just a little hint on the side. You have two options. You leave, you forget what you have seen. You do whatever you're doing and you hope that somehow you get some other results. Good luck with that. Or you click the link below the video. You enter your email address because I'm not showing this to everybody. You at least watch my video on how I plan to 1000x my money. The choice is yours. Make the right choice. Join me. See what a different future you could have. See at least how I intend, how I plan to do the 1000x. So click on the link below, enter your email address and I see you on the other side. Your Markus Dahn.